Why are there still so many substandard products on the market, even when the standards exist? According to the Bureau of Standards, the problem is partially internal. The standards are poorly marketed. A set of standards uh, is under one department, which is the Standards and Development Department. So we have a marketing and communication strategy in place, but you find uh, at times um, we are not well aligned. People are willing to pay for something if they perceive there to be a value in it, and that is our job as communicators and, and marketers is to get um, the, the standards user to understand the value um, of that document. Marketing standards is the new thing now consuming the enforcers like UNBS because it appears more than ever now they have no option. You see, you have to look at it this way. We haven't had a very huge manufacturing industry in the past, but that has grown and that has changed. Now, the manufacturers in Uganda are doing their best to meet standards so that people can take up their products first in Uganda, then regionally, then internationally, okay? So you have to up your game to be able to reduce what you are importing. We were a net importing country because we were not making a lot of these things here. But that is changing. Uganda has over 3,000 standards, and the battle is for those to be translated into actual standard and healthy products, which for now remains a dream far away. Eroni Kamkama, NTV Business.